Hi everyone and welcome to Mike's Movie Reviews. Tonight I'll be reviewing the movie Mulan. It's a Disney movie. Uh, the star of the movie is played by Yiffy Lu. And um, the movie, honey, you have to get out. The movie is set in China. Uh, Mulan's father is is a pretty old man and uh, has been in many wars. He's a, like a war hero. Uh, he was called to war again, and she, Mulan, puts his armor on and takes his sword and goes in his place. She trains alongside all the men, but they don't find out she's a girl uh, at all for a long time. And before their training is complete, uh, they're called uh, to action before they're done training. Uh, something changes her during a battle and she becomes herself. Um, so let's get started on the uh, on the trailer and I've got some trivia that I'll be telling you uh, during this. Has found you an auspicious match. It is decided. Come and sit down. It is what is best for our family. Yes, I will bring honor to us all. Okay, there she is. There she is, right there, and. Uh, the first bit of trivia I have uh, is Yiffy performed 90% of all of her stunts as Mulan. Uh, horse riding, sword fighting, uh, martial arts, and battle scenes. She did all that. Okay. I don't know if they've shown the next... Okay, you can see their training and everything there. Um, actor and martial artist Jet Li, who plays uh, the Emperor, admitted uh, turning down the role because of the script and pay. After his daughters reminded him it was an important for Disney to shine a light on Chinese culture, then he, ex he accepted. It's primarily shot in New Zealand, believe it or not, with a few scenes in mainland China. I do think there's some other ones here. Let me see. There was one other I'd like for you to maybe be able to see here. It was, uh, it might have been this one here. Let me get it going. Nix sits on the right hand of the emperor. She is his guardian, his protector. But she's both beautiful and strong. Your job is to bring honor to the family. Do you think you can do that? Citizens, we are under attack from northern invaders. 
calls himself. Okay, right there. You see that that guy that was running up that wall there. Uh, that is, I'll tell you in just a minute. Uh, first Disney live action remake to receive a PG-13 rating. Uh, heavily implying death. Other uh, wise, there's no nudity, profanity, or blood. So I, I believe your kids could watch this. I mean, they're going to see probably worse than that just on regular TV. But uh, did I miss something? Let's see. Christina Aguilera performs an updated version of the song Reflection for this film. And I missed something here. I was going to... Gently. Well, anyway, the guy that played this one you just saw running up the wall here, that is Jason Scott Lee. Uh, and he was in the movie, um, the Disney movie uh, Jungle Book. He played Mowgli. And uh, let's go a little bit. Side of which, no survivors. By edict of his imperial majesty, every family must contribute one man to fight. If you know son, I am blessed with two daughters. I will fight. We must destroy. This time we will not. Uh, a close up of the scene. Uh, a close-up shot of the underside of one of the broken teacups in a scene where they're training her, I guess, to be to do womanly things. You know, she was fixing to get. They were going to promise her to marry this somebody at the first, and she, they're trying to train her, and she broke some teacups. But if you look uh, at one of uh, one of the broken teacups, reveals a made in Taiwan mark. So that's a big blooper right there. Okay. Loyal, brave, and true. It is my duty to protect my family. Okay, you can see her there where she was made up like a man, although I thought her face kind of looked like, you know, still looked like a woman. Uh, she tried to talk, you know, with a deeper voice or this or that, but um, they didn't seem to know, and they, they, they would ask her why, uh, tell her she needed to take a bath, because <laughs> she wouldn't bathe with all the men, because she's afraid they would, you know, notice, obviously, so. She was binding herself, you know, to make it look like she was a man. So that's when they were talking about, you know, at the first, like I said. Yes, I will bring honor to us all. Quiet. Okay, I think we may have seen this part. But, y'all, uh, I really enjoyed this movie. Um, I, I enjoy, you know, all Disney movies pretty much. They're all well-made. Some beautiful scenery. Uh, they had some special effects in this, you know. It wasn't a major, major thing in it. Uh, I would definitely give this movie at least a, a four and a half. Uh, four and a half red trucks. 
uh, that'll be my system. My rating is, is in red trucks. So <laughs> four and a half out of five red trucks. So I hope y'all uh, check out this film if you haven't. I know it was out, you know, early in the year, uh, like June or July, something like that. It took them a long time for it to, to come to uh, to rent or to own, you know, to come out. So, uh, but it was worth it. So uh, I would definitely, you know, say to check out this film. I hope you enjoy it, and uh, please press that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that so you get all my videos as soon as they come out. I'll be doing another Mike's Movie Reviews as soon as we uh, rent another movie or see one that I haven't seen. So everybody have a great evening, and I'll see you in the morning at Morning Devotions. God bless.